Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we are going to learn about Terraform import command. So basically in the previous videos we have gone through the concept of Terraform apply command. And Terraform import command is just the opposite of what a Terraform apply command is. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So the foremost thing that I would like to share is that with the help of Terraform apply command, we create the resources with the help of TF state file. And the TF state file is the one that keeps the track of those resources, right? But in few cases, like if what if we already have got that resource created, but that resource is not under the control of Terraform. Right. We can't control or operate it with the help of Terraform. So in order to bring that resource under the control of Terraform, what we do is we make use of Terraform import command. So in this, we are going to actually implement it with an example. So in this video, we are going to consider an EC2 instance and then try to import that particular EC2 instance onto our Terraform. So let's get started. So let's go to our EC2 dashboard first. Okay. So in this, I will be launching an EC2 instance. Um, the name, let's give it my instance. Okay. So this is the name of my EC2 instance. And let's try to copy this AMI ID also. We may require it in the future. So I'm just trying to select that. Let me copy it first. I'll just copy this and paste it over here. Fine. Now I have selected this Amazon Linux as the type of AMI for my EC2 instance. So if you don't know how to create an EC2 instance, you must first go and uh, watch the videos that have some insights on how to create an EC2 instance manually. Okay, so I'm just creating that, nothing else. You won't require anything as of now, but still for your understanding, you can go and check that out. Okay, so I have just um, selected all the necessary stuff that is name then i have selected the ami id and then after that we select the instance type i will be selecting it to be t2.micro and the rest of the things i will try to keep it as it is okay and launch instance okay so the key pair is something that i was missing um okay I'll go with this and launch instance. Now you can see that my instance has been launched successfully. It may take some time to come to the state of running. But yeah, I will try to refresh it. Now you can see that my instance is in the running state. Okay. Now let's go to our VS code and type some Terraform configuration right here. Okay, so the foremost thing that I will be mentioning in my main.tf is provider. I will be mentioning the provider as AWS. And keep in mind that your AWS must be already configured. Okay, US East 1. Okay, so this is my provider. Now, what I want to do is, I'll just go and try to initialize. 
ओके टेरा फॉर्म इन इट इट इज इंस्टॉलिंग ऑल द प्रोवाइडर प्लग इन्स and now you can see that it has created this particular dot terraform folder along with this particular log file okay so now in order to import the aws instance what we need to do is we first need to declare that resource that is our aws instance okay and then within the we will be giving any resource name over here let's consider ec2 instance okay and just try to mention the ami id okay so what we are doing is we are mentioning all the things that our ec2 instance already has so that terraform can read it okay and for that what we do is we simply run terraform import command and it will do its job okay so what i'll do is i'll be mentioning the ami over here okay i'll just go to my notepad and copy this stuff okay it will be in inverted commas of course and i'll be pasting it right here then we have to mention the instance type as i already mentioned i had um used sorry t2.micro as my instance type and we are going to mention the tags out here okay and the key will be like name and the name of my instance is my underscore instance right so this is what i'll be mentioning what all parameters we have used to create that particular instance we are going to mention them here as it is nothing to worry about just simply mention those parameters out here and now how the terraform import command is working right here okay now in order to use terraform import command we have got a particular syntax for it now what is the syntax i will try to sh write it over here in short okay in command i'll write so we make use of terraform import okay then we mention the resource underscore type okay dot resource name and this resource is something that should match your this resource and it can be anything okay it is not necessary that you have to mention it as ec2 instance only you can mention it any you can mention any name right here okay so that is the thing so terraform import resource type dot resource name and then add a space to it and mention the resource id over here okay so in this way you have to do the you have to run the command so let's go to our cli and try to um uh, import our ec2 instance right so the resource type over here is of course aws instance underscore instance right dot now whatever the name is i have chosen ec2 underscore instance as my name right followed by the resource id 
Now let's go to our EC2 console and in here you can see that this is the instance ID over here, right? So how we just need to copy this particular, okay, it's just, I'll just copy this and now I am going to paste it right here as it is, okay? So this is how you import a resource, okay? So I'll just say enter. And now it is trying to import that particular resource, okay? Into our terraform.tf state file. And now in here you can see that we have got this particular AWS instance with this particular name and all the details are being mentioned right here understood so in this way we can import an ec2 instance okay and make our tf state file aware or keep use our tf state file to track that already created resource now we can manage that particular resource with the help of different terraform commands like apply plan and etc okay so with this we were successfully able to import a resource onto our terraform right so hope you found this video helpful please like share and subscribe to my channel if you found the videos helpful also don't forget to press that bell icon for the latest updates so thank you so much and have a nice day